Hello everyone. So today we're going to figure out what is wrong with the Singer M1000. Uh, for some reason it's, it is just not catching the bobbin thread. So here today um, I'm going to show you how to fix this problem. As you can see here, that's just one example of why it is, it is not catching the, the bobbin thread. So today we're going to be using these tools. It's one of the mini uh, Allen key and also a tool that came with uh, the sewing machine to unscrew these type of screw that they have on here. Takes a little bit of work, but eventually you'll get there. And then screw the other side. What's next is we're going to remove this cover piece, a plastic cover piece, so that we can have access to the bobbin. Take that out as well. And then we're going to replay, uh, remove this faceplate right here. Um, a little bit tricky, but you know, just, a little bit, uh, just pry a little and it should come apart. I'm actually doing this with one hand, so it's kind of difficult. There we go. Just got to tilt this little guy up. And then you should be able to just slide that out. And we'll take this piece here. We'll take that out so that we can adjust the... So if you look at the bottom of the uh, sewing machine, there's this little piece right here. So I use this tool, uh, the X-Acto knife or the, the knife, to pry it open. So once you have it open, you can see here in the gear section, there is a little screw in there. And by using the knob on the right of the sewing machine, you turn it, you should be able to see that screw. And now we're gonna use the small Allen key that we have here to just loosen that screw. Just loosen just a little bit. So don't loosen it all the way. And then if you turn the knob again, uh, you should see like the second screw that needs to be loosened as well once you have it loosened flip the machine back and now you should uh, be able to adjust the catcher i'm not sure if i got that right but you can actually use your hand to adjust where it needs to be so that it catches the thread um, what you want to do is that you want to lower your needle to the lowest point and then turn that wheel by hand so that it catches, it catches the thread like that. And then you use the knob on the right and it's just turn it to see if it fully catches the thread. As you can see here again. It's catching our thread now. And that should be it. And then all you gotta do now is just put back the pieces, like how you took it out. Just gotta adjust it correctly, like that. Now we put back the faceplate. And the plastic piece. So now here you can see that once I turn the 
Now on the right of the sewing machine, you can see in here that it is catching the thread, the bobbin thread. There we go. And that is it. Now one thing I want to mention is that before you even uh, try to see uh, if it catches the, the bobbin thread, you would want to tighten up the screws on the bottom of the sewing machine. That is something that I didn't um, uh, told you guys. So make sure you tighten those and then you do your test and you should be good to go. Thanks for watching.